Hello and welcome back to another Walking Dead Daryl Dixon video and today I'll be talking about season 3 as filming for the third season has just started and everything seems very different to what we were expecting. So when filming started the other day we got some set photos and these set photos it is clear season 3 is apparently set in England not Spain even though we've had months of filming in Spain, months of promotion of Daryl moving to Spain. It's like no 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 no. It's filmed in Spain, but the show is set in England. It is very confusing. What is going on? Why choose Madrid, Spain to have it look like London? It's very confusing. Maybe this is just a one-off thing. But you can see Daryl and Carol are on the sets. So why would they be in England one minute, but Spain the rest? They are very, very different countries and they are very far away from each other. And it is just very confusing because we had months of Spain, Spain, Spain. We get to the filming and we're like, okay, they're in Spain. It's starting. Why does everything look like London? Why are we seeing a double decker bus? Why are we seeing a London taxi? Why are we seeing a car with GB license plates? It is just insane that we are having this big reveal and it does suck because they're filming before season 2 comes out so we now know that okay in season 3 they're going to England not Spain. In the trailer we did kind of see them going through the Euro Tunnel so it's like okay there is a hint maybe that that shot is actually from the end of the season where they're like okay the plane's gone let's just walk through the Euro Tunnel to get to England. That could be what happened and that makes more sense to them than going from the north of France all the way down to the bottom to go head to Spain if you think about it. Also it does make a lot of sense to choose England story wise because in season one it was clearly laid out to get back to America you have to first go to England and get a ride from England to the States. Spain doesn't really have a place in that plan so it makes a lot more sense if they're trying to get home they would head north to England instead of heading south to Spain. I also did go back and reread the synopsis and the synopsis just talks about them on their journey home and being led further astray. I took it as being led further astray as they end up going south instead of north and end up in Spain. But it could be like on their journey home they end up in England but they're led further astray and caught into something for two seasons. That could be how the synopsis is meant to be read. And I just personally don't know how to feel about this. On one hand I'm really excited that we're getting the walking dead in England but on the other hand it baffles me why they chose Spain to film and it's like the mental gymnastics of AMC being like okay we can't film in France anymore how we choose Spain but set in England two countries with very different cultures very different climates and very different architecture both countries have buildings looking very different you're going to go to the capital city of Spain and then dress it up to look like the capital city of England is dumb you're going to have to use a lot of sets a lot of sound stages a lot of like close-ups and a lot of CGI to hide the way the buildings look drastically different to the way they do in England like why if you don't want to film in England to have your show set in England why don't you film in a country that has similar architecture to that country if season three is set in England why did they not just go to Scotland film it in Scotland film it in Wales film it in Northern Ireland or the Republic of Ireland or even continue filming in France because the architecture in France is closer to the architecture in England than the architecture in Spain the climates are similar so the buildings will look similar if you're just going to be like okay we're filming Madrid and all we're doing is putting some leaves on just putting a big double decker bus in some cabs and bam it's London it's going to look dumb the countries just look completely different they are not going to look like it's in England. It's going to look like, oh, you're obviously in Spain, but you have a London cab here and a double-decker bus. It looks dumb. It's really stupid. This is why I'm thinking maybe that there's maybe only one episode in England, two episodes in England, and then Darren and Carol get on a plane or somehow crash in Spain, and the rest of the season and the season after is set in Spain after. That's what I'm thinking is happening. They head north, they try to head west, and they end up in Spain then. That's what I think has happened and that would make more sense and why they're like, okay, we're only having one or two episodes in England, no point filming in England, just dress up the sets like England and then we'll then set in Spain. That's what I think is happening other than two seasons in Spain but made it look like England would be super dumb. And maybe that could be what the synopsis means, their way home but they're led further astray. Their way home crashes and they end up in Spain. That could be the further astray part of the story. So there definitely is, like, I'm not reaching, reaching, but I am slightly reaching. But that's what I think is most likely the case. It's not AMC being dumb and trying to dress up Spain as England. So that's what I'm reaching for right now because otherwise it is just absolutely dumb. They're just adding a lot more work for them to do to try and make this look like a convincing 
England also, if they do the countryside, England and Spain's countryside are drastically different. It's like night and day. Spain's a lot more hot, they're a lot more dry, it's a bit more deserty, and they actually have wilderness. England's countryside is just fields, farms and fields, for the as far as the eyes can see, and a bit of hills. So how are you going to convey that when you're currently working with that? But please tell me down below, what do you think about this season 3 news? Are you excited about England? Are you disappointed that we won't get Spain? I'd like to know all your thoughts down below. But that's it for me today, so goodbye, peace out, and I'll talk to you later.